All right, welcome back to your balance diet of Teletainment, the Good Morning Niger show. Now, we'll begin this particular interview uh, with one of Nigeria's social activists and politicians, um, Imna Edi Areona Kankafo of Yoruba Land. Um, we'll be actually interview him and he talk plenty of things, even concerning this uh, Amoteku, I hope I pronounce that well. Well, we're concerning them and concerning insecurity, talk about plenty of things. You want to know what he in talk? Well, watch this interview where we'll get with Chief Ganiyu Adams. I, I did not call for synergy between OPC and police. It's the communique that came out from the summit organized in Ibadan, September, by the Nigerian police, which have three governor, three deputy governor. So, is the synergy, is the communique, sorry, is the communique that came out from that uh, conference, which the Nigerian police agreed to partner with the police and other relevant uh, security group in Southwest. So, uh, when you are talking of partnership, before this conference, Nigerian police have been working with OPC. So definitely, what happened on that conference was for the IG to even legitimize the cooperation. is quite different from uh, partnership with the police. Partnership with the police is a result of uh, community policing. Amoteku is a private security outfit, a security outfit organized by the state, Southwest State Government. Amoteku itself, we even partner, we even have synergy with Nigerian police, SSS, Nigerian Army, other federal security agencies. So when you are talking of partnership, is in between Amoteku and the police now. OPC will be part of Amoteku. The launch will be tomorrow. After the launch, I believe psychologically, it will dose the uh, tension. It will dose the tensions of the rampart attack on our farmers. And it will dose the tensions and ugly activities of kidnapping our people at will, either in the roads or in the farms and in the communities. You are talking of uh, the content of the DG of uh, down submission. I think uh, I don't understand his submission about talking of uh, you don't want to re recruit illiterate. Uh, what we have on ground is that uh, we are, uh, the government was looking for a group psychologically that can face this problem. This is just security outfit. It's not a state police. If it is state police now, there will be a certain qualification, maybe a school start, minimum school start, to join the recruitment. But when you are talking of uh, having hunters, how many literally do we have in the hunters in the bush? How many literally do we have in vigilante? How many, how, how much literally do we have in OPC2? Those, it's only those who are deprived that can lay their life for their own nation and their own tribe. Shea did not understand the rudiment of organization. And uh, he was trying, he was just trying to play into the gallery to suit those who approve his proposal in government house. And at the same time, 
He have even told me, confirmed on me, that there is not a charge of recruitment. That there is the only security advisor that is in charge. And he even told me that it's OPC that's, that secured them in his own house and their streets. So when I read in the newspaper yesterday that I was saying that they, they, won't, they won't recruit, they won't recruit easy trade and uh, those who take loss, who take loss into their hands? Those who take loss into their hands will be hung with the cover of law. TEPCO is just like a temporary way, temporary relief in terms of our security. So when you are talking of restructuring, the only content of restructuring is state police and local government police. If it is local government police and state police, we'll be talking about requiting on certain guidelines. Even the Amotekun will have its own guideline, but it's limit to state police and local government police. Well, first thing what we are doing now is to use Olo Festival Foundation. You know, Olo Festival Foundation have made its own grant. Uh, I can sell as a real account for, I'm still the ship promoter of Olo Festival Foundation to resuscitate our cultural festival in every community, which we believe is the foundation of cultural promotion. Because if we don't resuscitate our cultural festival, people from different communities will not know their history. They won't know the importance of their heritage, which, which is their deities. Okay, to and the hill in your community. If you don't do festival for it, they won't know the importance. In between the uh, festival, we will tell you the story, what the hill have done for you when the community started when your people migrated to that community. The stream in your community, when there is no pipe bone water or borehole, how your forefather always went there and take water to drink and use it to cook and to bath. And what the spirit of that water have been doing for you is very important. We read the spirit, the spirit, what spirit do in the Bible. We read what all the prophets do in the Bible. What of our own history? Are we not human beings? Why should we be so inferior about what, how God created us? Even those people in Zion have the very greater history than us. We too have to manage the one we have. If people did not glorify, if you don't glorify yourself, nobody will glorify you. It sounds so stupid of demonizing yourself, glorifying another person. So definitely what we are trying to do is that they, we are trying to make sure we we rebuild the pe the confident backs to our heritage and our identity through these festivals, which we have been doing. After then, when we have more resources, we now work on Yoruba Language Center, which attracts a very big resources. All right, yes, that's now the interview where we get wet with Chief Ganiyu Adams. And you talk about the insecurity and um, also the Amotekun project, um, we're actually day on ground. But we're going to play um, bit by bit to you. Um, still more things when you come as I talk, and then we're going to play them um, for you as the week um, they unfold. To enjoy more of this, our Ubunke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.